Tamil is an ancient language with rich literature that is at least 2300 years old. But where exactly can we find this literature? We know that most of it was written on dried palm leaves. But can palm leaves really stay intact for over 2000 years? They can't. For hundreds of years, there was a tradition of kings and wealthy men commissioning copies to copy ancient texts from old to new palm leaves. So every generation had its own reprints of these ancient texts. But over time, such sponsorships declined. Many palm leaves were lost or they languished in storerooms, their value forgotten. Enter Dr. U. V. Swaminatha Iyer, a Tamil professor from Kumbhakonam. In 1880, he was challenged by a friend to annotate a 10th century Tamil Jain manuscript called Sivaka Sintamani. This epic poem was a masterpiece in Jain philosophy, but was practically lost by them. Dr. Swaminatha launched a house-to-house -house hunt for the surviving palm leaves, travelling to the remotest villages in Tamil Nadu. He convinced owners to part with their palm leaves so that he could decipher and republish them. Seven years later, he released a near-perfect compilation of Sivaka Sintamani. Over the next 30 years, he collected over 3,000 manuscripts and published over 90 books. His contribution to Tamil literature is so significant that Tamil Nadu fondly remembers him as Tamil Tata or Tamil Grandpa. We are at the Presidency College in Chennai and this is U.V. Swaminatha Iyer, the man who helped us rediscover ancient Tamil literature. 